everyone, Giano here, the bizarre one, if you will, bizarre, bizarre. You know, I um, speaking of the uh, bizarre, you know, I, I constantly use it as my username online. Bizarre, for those who don't know, it actually means mask. And so I, that's the reason why I constantly come with masks. This time I came with one that I made myself. Uh, well, I designed it. Uh, the sewing was actually done by Wordbox, but I designed the lenses and the, uh, the lines that are going up on it because I figure it might be a good idea to actually have something for the show. But anyway. So I'm here this week with my picks, um, and I'm excited for actually for this week of comics, mostly because of the fact that we get to deal with more BS from DC about how they're going to continue to piss people off. So we're going to actually start with my top current pick, which is Heroes in Crisis number three. Um, in this one, we are continuing on from where... Booster Gold admitted to the uh, to at least the happenings of the sanctuary the sanctuary to Barry Allen, especially the fact of uh, spoiler alert Wally West being dead, and Flash is losing it. We've got Superman, Wonder Woman, and Batman trying to figure out. You know, they just tried to take down Harley, and she outsmarted all three of them. So the two main culprits are on the run, and. On this one, it's supposed to be Batman and The Flash teaming up using their detective skills to try to figure out exactly what is going on. And more secrets and stuff coming out. <clears throat> but that's my main pick. Uh, as well as Detective Comics number 993. We're slowly getting on to Detective Comics 1000. Um, this one, the, I believe when we last left off, was Batman and Two-Face teaming up to help take down Cobra. Um... I'm really excited. I love what they've done with Detective Comics, how they keep it more detective versus just a lot of action-packed, a lot of fighting. It's actually more about discovery, and it gives a little bit more depth into the characters. Um, so very, very excited for that one. And then uh, going over to Marvel, we're going to continue with the Spider-Geddon event with Spider-Girls number three, where you have May Parker, also known as Mayday or Mayhem, because she's half symbiote. You've got uh, Aron um what is her name? Uh, well, either way, the third, Arachne, and Spiderling from the Renew Your Vows comic, who is the daughter of Peter and Mary Jane, um, that survived in their world. But the three of them were on their Earth trying to help uh, use um, Spiderling, uh, Annie Parker's, abilities to help track down the inhibitors and try to help put a stop with them. It's a continued tie-in with the spider Geddon event, and... The spider Gun event has actually blown me out of the water. I've really enjoyed it. Um, it seems like it's set up kind of a, a typical spider fashion, but I'm hoping for more good twists and turns, and I swear to God, if they kill my boy Kane, I'm going to war. But uh, So those are my three picks for the week. So we've got Detective Comics number 993. We've got Spider Girls number two, and my top one is Heroes in Crisis number three. This is me signing off. You can find me on Instagram at Bizarre Bizarre. Don't find me on Facebook because I won't add you. Yep. All right, roller rolling sound speed. Action.